oh my god, I can ask anything. <laughs> Uh, I, I was thinking uh, that I would uh, like you to end this uh, sentence, uh, which goes like, live, love, and what could be the third <laughs> for you? Uh, and a sleep, maybe. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> a, lot, a lot of things happen when, uh, when you sleep. Yeah, that's. True. I dream. I dream a lot, and I usually remember uh, clearly my dreams or, okay. or, or nightmares. It depends. Do you write them? Do you write them down? Uh, no, but when I wake up, uh, I uh, try to remember what I've been dreaming. Okay. Oh, that's and true. If, if Marina is around, uh, I explain it to to her, <laughs> <laughs> and so... she runs away. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, that's lovely. <laughs> Um, if you could choose one international collaborational partner, who, who would be your like dream international collaboration partner? Maybe Faiz, the, she's a, um, from Canada. And um, yeah, I like, I like her a lot, her music. And uh, yeah, that would be very, very nice. So let's fingers crossed that you can collaborate and that will be really nice. Oh, uh, I often get uh, questions about my uh, choice of uh, instrument, why accordion? And I need to explain people why I chose accordion. But why did you choose to play the guitar? Uh, it was it was a kind of an accident. Um, <laughs> okay. Like almost everything. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I, I think I was I was six. I was six when I found an old guitar at home, and um, it had only uh, three strings. But I was lucky because uh, they were in tune, so I could. Uh, I could focus on my right hand and training my ear and uh, just singing. And uh, it was not a, like a traumatic approach to an instrument. So, yeah, that's why, because it's, it's, uh, I think I'm, uh, I get scared easily. So it was like a very peaceful beginning with music for me. It's funny because uh, for me it happened when I was eight and I found an old accordion. Mm. It was also really peaceful, no pressure, because uh, yeah, yeah pe people did not understand why a girl wants to play the accordion. <laughs> and they just left me alone <laughs> so I could do my thing, <laughs> which I'm still doing. And they still sometimes don't understand <laughs> because mm. it's heavy and it's looking like really ugly when I sit <laughs> with my no, it's not. <laughs> yeah. So it was really no trauma involved because I've heard a lot of like music school traumas and like traumatic uh, yeah. beginnings for people. So, mm -hmm. so there, I totally share this with you. It's so funny. <laughs> I was not really uh, waiting this answer for me. <laughs> it sounded like, oh my God, it just took my line, which just had two years. <laughs> I was two years older. Uh, yeah. Uh, your perfect day what would that be my perfect day um, having a, a good and slow breakfast uh, maybe going to the market um, and um, yeah maybe uh being able to create a new tune or a song or something like this. Yeah. Do you like uh, cooking? Yeah, I, I wouldn't say it, it's it's a passion, a passion, passion. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, I kind of like it. So you would go to the market and buy some stuff for a long breakfast. Yeah, good uh, cheese. What? Okay, cheese. Okay. Bread. Oh. Uh, tomatoes. We we eat here uh, bread with uh, tomatoes, and uh, a good tomato makes a difference. 
I can agree totally. I love like those really big ones which grow a bit like up and they are really meaty inside. Yeah. This is my favorite tomato. So I love tomatoes. I can eat like loads of them. So are you more a coffee or a tea person then? Coffee. Uh, coffee person. So you would make a strong espresso to a long breakfast? Uh, cafe latte, I think. Cafe latte. With, with uh, oak milk. Mm. Well, that's nice. Oh, that sounds so delicious. I'm now I'm almost like sitting there in my dreams and there's a lot of sun and yeah, because the sun is setting here now and it starts to get uh, colder in Estonia in September, so so probably it's not happening where you are or is it when when yeah, is it getting yeah. colder? But here is so hot. <laughs> The air is not so. <laughs> but people in in northern countries are always complaining that it's uh, it's never hot enough. So we need to come to Spain to have mm. holidays where it's hot. And you would maybe like to come here where it's not so hot. Yeah, here yeah. In August in the city, it's not a good idea. Okay, yeah, but maybe you can sit inside and make some new music. Who knows? Who knows? Mm. Yeah, great. It was really great to talk and and ask stuff from you. And uh, yeah, looking forward to your focus week and, uh, so that I can share some stuff. Yeah, that one more question, which I just forgot. Your album name. Uh, mm-hmm. What? What's? Uh, I I did not uh, run it through Google Translate. I thought I need to ask it from you. <laughs> yeah, what, it's what called it? Asmals Customs, which means bad habits in English. Okay. Kind of uh, in a personal way or in a social way, it's yeah, bad habits. Something that we repeat, even though it's not working. <laughs> Good point. We need to check our habits. So <laughs> great. So I will be sharing some bad habits in my social media feed during your focus week. <laughs> Superb. Thank you, Anna. Thank you, Tuliki.